Hello my friends and welcome back to another Super Mario Maker 2 video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the newest levels being made in Mario Maker 2. As many of you know, you can go into the courses menu and you can take a look at a bunch of different levels in different ways. And we're going to be taking a look at the new courses to see what kind of levels people are making. Now these are going to be levels that have never been played before. These are fresh out of the creator's oven. They could be really good. More than likely they're going to be really bad. So without further ado, we're going to fire up these new courses and just see how bad they actually are. So as you guys know, there are dozens of levels being built and submitted in Mario Maker 2 probably every minute. So let's go ahead and hit refresh and see what the freshest course available is. And the first one is called Chomp Chomp. This actually, just from the small preview, it looks like it's decent. Again, zero clears. No one's played it yet. So let's go ahead and fire up Chomp Chomp and uh, see what the first level of the day has in store. So here we go with Chomp Chomp. Yeah, this seems very normal right out the gates uh i'm i know the level has literally just started oh well there's the chomp chomps i know the level has just started but i am i'm honestly i thought we were gonna die there <laughs> once again why do i talk but quite honestly i'm pleasantly surprised with our first level of the day it seems very very good so oh, okay i thought we needed the spring or something but honestly this is a really really well designed level man this is uh <laughs> rookie mistake rookie indeed dave no in all honesty i couldn't ask for much of a better better level to start oh there's a checkpoint checkpoint city baby it's a beautiful city, that Checkpoint City, but honestly, I couldn't ask for a much better level to start today's episode with. This is a fantastically created level now. Okay, we can't go down the... Oh, baby. Okay, all right, we're alive. Goodness gracious, this is a really, really cool level. Oh, goodness! Is this the end? I'm scared. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my gosh. I, quite honestly, when I started up this episode, I thought honestly we're, we were just going to be getting hit with hot garbage after hot garbage after hot garbage. A lot of people play these new levels to try and rack up world record clears so that they can get the outfits that come with having enough world records. Me, I'm not doing that. I just wanted to see what the new levels held in store for us, but this was a a great way to start and you know what i always say they might take our world record but they will never take our first clear so i hit refresh again i'm kind of torn liliana looks like it's a really really bad level but bounce shot basement escape looks like it's pretty fun as well maybe we'll try both of those but let's uh let's fire up liliana first it's got no description it shows uh one of those warp boxes just floating in midair this should be pretty good. All right, here we go with Liliana. I can only imagine Lilo made this for Liliana. Maybe this is his way of trying to cap capture his the woman of his dreams heart or something. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What is this? <laughs> I um Liliana, apparently that level was for you. May you guys live happily ever after. As I said, I want to check out this bounce shot basement escape because this looks like it's a legitimately well-designed level. So let's go ahead and fire this one up and see how it is. All right, here we go with this bounce shot. I, I'm pretty excited. I don't get to use the Super Ball nearly enough. So I'm pretty pumped about this. Um, sweet. Sweet Mama's Nectar, that worked. Yeah, this is already a well-designed level. You can already tell. This is a fantastically designed level. Um, so... Hmm. 
because I don't use the super ball too much this this might take me a while <laughs> this might take me a while indeed uh hmm I'm tempted to cheese this <laughs> I, I may have cheesed that just a wee bit <laughs> <laughs> the arrows are normally really helpful when it comes to these Super Ball levels. This one uh, doesn't seem to have quite the level of intricacy as some Super Ball levels I've played, but it's it's not bad so far. Oh, that was close. Oh, we got it! We in there, boys! We in there! Look at that accuracy! I am deadly with a Super Ball in my hand. Alright, we're gonna cheese this again. <laughs> we went for the cheese again. <laughs> Forgive me, level creator. If there's cheese, I intend to find it. Ooh. 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 Ooh! There we go. So, what is... Oh. oh. Okay, there we go. There's another super ball. Definitely gonna cheese this too. I should honestly, there's enough cheese in this level that I can wear my cheese hat. Semi-transparent cheese hat. It's uh, I think it's safe to wear it. <laughs> I was, okay, That I made that wit. I don't deserve to wear this cheese hat anymore. This is where we died last time. Let's not make the same mistake here. There we go. Still stand over the platform this time. There we go. There's the ending. <laughs> I still can't believe how I died. But overall, it was a fun lo- But yeah, I'm just really curious if that level creator who made that Super Bowl level realized there was some cheese, took it down so that they could re-upload it. I'm very curious about that. <laughs> All right, the next level that we have is called- <laughs> You'll be fine. <laughs> and it says, hey fans, um, I'm a voice in Perseer, so my Instagram is 24 eroy I'm Lonely Lamo. Should I understand that? Listen, I'm 30. I'm out of the I'm out of the game. I don't know what that means. I I don't know what an impressior is, but if you guys have Instagram, there you go. You can check out this this dude, he's a voice in, in Perseor. Alright, this level's called You'll Be Fine. Now this looks to be the hot garbage we've been waiting for if this even takes us to the end if this even takes us to the end <laughs> that's the garbage we signed up for for this video i gotta get a better world record though i i'm not content there we go there we go that should be a tough world record to beat <laughs> i'm saying i'm not saying it's not beatable but it was it was a pretty good run, almost flawless. If this one caught my attention, it says cave parkour very hard. Let's see how hard this level actually is by Ethson. Um, we'll be the judge how hard this level is, Ethson. You know it's New Super Mario Brothers themed. Okay, so it's, it's a little tricky. It's a little tricky. Ethan, I see what you're throwing down. I like what's going on with this. <laughs> How am I not dead? How am I not dead? Dude, look at this. Let me just zoom in on this. We are a, probably one frame off from falling off the pipe and one frame from dying to the piranha plants. Nonetheless, we take it. Okay. I like what this level's got going on for it. Now, I don't like that there's a very blind jump here. I saw the Goomba, but it was too far away for me to good, get a good judgment on how far I needed to jump. Okay. Okay, got Yoshi. Hmm. Sad we had to ditch, ditch Yoshi, but we got the checkpoint city, man. Sometimes 
You need to sacrifice for the greater good. <laughs> I'm sorry, Yoshi. Ooh. Ooh. Baby, that was actually pretty dang tricky section. How did I save that? <laughs> How did I save it? Hopefully we can beat the level on this one. That was a, uh, that was a nice save. I, I will give myself. I was gonna say I was, I'm gonna give myself some credit there. No, I'm not. I take it. I take it all back. Can I finally beat the level here? Yes, I can. <laughs> that was a really fun level. It was really well designed. Uh, you know, aesthetically, there wasn't much going on, but it doesn't change the fact that it was, a, it was a pretty well designed level. I liked it. We got the first clear. They can take our world record, but they can't take our first, first clear. All right, this just caught my eye. This level just caught my eye. It's called the Spaghetti Factory. This is the easiest troll level I have made. The title is lying. The thumbnail is too. Let's fire up this one and uh, see if it's any better than the last one. All right, here we go with the spaghetti factory. Woo! All right, all right, all right, right away. Okay. Okay, this is a pretty fast paced. Pretty fast paced troll level so far. Apparently, this is wrong. Apparently, this is the wrong way. Was this the wrong way? The level sure has me thinking it was. <laughs> okay, this is pretty good. It's not a troll level unless you run into a forced death area. All right. I like this level so far. Now this is itching while well, I'm itching my arm, but this is itching my troll fancy. Right right away, I can say my, my, troll, my troll fancy is being itched right now. So we know we wanna go left. Now the question we run into, do we want, do we want the mushroom? Hmm. Hmm. I think we did want it. Yep. Maybe? Uh, oh, maybe we don't, maybe we don't want it. Wait, what? Wait. What is going on here? Hold up. So now I'm kind of curious. Do we want it? Uh, can we go back here? Bro, that was brilliant. Oh, that was so cool. I I didn't even think of that of that being a thing. This is okay. I'm on board. I was kind of iffy with the level at first, but now I'm. Now, now I'm most definitely on board. I have played very few well-designed 3D world troll levels, and this seems to be, so far, it really seems to be a really well-designed one at the moment. So we know we don't want to, we don't want to chill around too long. There was Checkpoint City. All right, so what do I want to do here exactly? Just get close to this guy? Oh, so by throwing the power block, there must be something underneath the cannon launchers that if you throw the power block, it, it drops them. So now we can get the checkpoint. Checkpoint city, baby. It's a beautiful city, that checkpoint city. Now it looks like there's gonna be a way that we could, in theory, get sent back to checkpoint one. Actually, multiple ways to get sent back to checkpoint one. What? Huh, okay, well. I feel like this is not right. Normally when you get blocked in, yeah, there was a big no sign there. There was a big no sign that this is not the right way.
Aha! <laughs> Alright, well, we have to at least check the key box. Wait, so what happens? That's what happens. So it looks like we have to go this way. It, from from what I'm seeing, it says we have to go this way, but I, I don't know. We're just gonna roll with what's going on here. I, I like, I truly do enjoy what, what this level creator is doing. I think it, this, the level creator's name was Lunar something. Something we... Hey, we at least ruled it out. You don't wanna fall in the pit. I, I would have probably went that route eventually, but now we know for sure. Don't jump in the pit. Okay, so let's try this door. This is the only way that I'm seeing we can go here. Um. <laughs> I, why I didn't just do a normal jump there, why I felt I needed a long jump there, we may never know, but, uh, Live and learn. There's there's the troll blocks there. And I think we can just normal jump here. Oh, there's a second checkpoint, baby. Second flipping checkpoint. Let's go. Checkpoint City is a beautiful city, my friends. Okay. Wait, where'd my key go? Where'd my key go? Where'd my flipping key go? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I couldn't see it behind the timer of the level. Key Largo, Montego. All right, there we go. Through the key door. Okay, it says not to go up here. See how there's a sign that says not to go up? I don't think it was lying to us, friends. I don't think it was lying to us. So what we learned from our last life is that any form of jumping will get us killed. So what do we need to do here? Oh gosh, okay. I think we're okay. I think we're okay here, hopefully. Um. Oh my gosh. Okay, that would have been a brilliant troll. Now I know what to expect. So as you can tell, there's a green pipe and a red pipe here. And if you look over to the left, right where my face cam is at, it you're not supposed to know the red pipe is underneath it because you're, you're supposed to just go in the first pipe you see. But if we wait, we can actually go inside the red pipe. I think the, I think the green pipe would probably take us back to checkpoint one. All right, so we know we just want to chill out here. Do not wall jump because that will release one of those big spiky mice. And chill out here. Go through the red pipe. I really liked that section. That was cool. I think I was wrong. I think we were wrong, gang. <laughs> Troll creator! He knew! He flippin' knew! He knew I was going to. He must have known! We, the players, were going to think the correct path was through the red pipe. It wasn't the correct path! We can just chill out here now. I think. I mean, I think our only option is to go through the green pipe, right? I think that's our, our only option at this point. Green pipe. Okay, it wasn't wrong. <laughs> this level's got some pretty girthy trolls, man. I, I'm really enjoying my time with it. It's not scared to take some chances. And I like that. So again, I think this is the right way. Yes, it is the right way. That is that's really cool. 
I really, really like what's going on there. So as you can... What I was trying to say, I love what the level creator was doing there with the uh, the cannon. Now the cannon becomes sort of a ship back and forth. Now I'm not, I'm sure something is going to happen as we're riding it. Like it's probably going, something, that red cannon is, is throwing me off a little bit. Like what's gonna happen here? Okay, nothing yet. <laughs> Taking it one at a time. Something's gonna happen here. You just know it. Okay, it didn't. We didn't die, so that's good. That's good, friends. <laughs> Did you guys just see that? Just do it. He didn't just do it. Wait a second. Wait a second. Did this level creator just come up with a surefire level, a surefire plan? What? All right, this level just went from, this is a pretty good troll level to what the heck is going on, which is a staple of an exceptionally good troll level. I have no idea where the heck or what the heck I'm supposed to be doing right now. I mean, I, I don't know what to, maybe I'm supposed to go up here? Hmm, I mean it, <laughs> the answer to that question is no that that's not where we're supposed to go wow is this level just thick and ripe with all sorts of crazy trolls man this is uh most definitely one of the more intricate and funny 3d world troll levels that i've played we have another shot gang we know the ending is legit it's right here. I just have... How? Oh! I get it! I get it! I get it! Oh my gosh! That is... This is, oh goodness, I, I'm, I'm at a lack of words. So you'll notice, we hit this, you get the old ding dong. This is where we wanna go, gang. We want to get sent back to the checkpoint. How filthy is that? Dude, who made this? This dude will be getting a follow from me once, once we're done with this level. So I can't say enough good things about this ending. I, I mean, there's still some to go, but I, I understand the concept of what's going on with this so we want to chill out there okay go through that it the creator then makes you think oh no what do i do now but we need to be quick up through the green pipe in through that box I'm about 99% sure that was correct, but I panicked and went to the left. I needed to land on the P switch to get to the safe zone. The saga continues. Oh my goodness. All right, well, let's give this another chance. Another shot here. So I, I kind of know what's going on. So down through this box again, quickly down through the pipe. Fall down here. Okay, wow, that's actually pretty tight. So now we wanna land on the P-switch again. 
And there we can get the ending. Oh my gosh. That ending was S tier. That was like an S tier ending to a troll level. It took me a, a little bit to figure out what was going on, but my goodness, what, what can you say, man? That was just excellent. Getting the DGR trolled stamp of approval. That was, that was a really, really well done Super Mario 3D World style troll level, which are pretty rare. Of all the new courses we've checked out in today's episode, I'm definitely recommending the Spaghetti Factory by Lunar Scrap. Definitely gonna be giving Lunar Scrap a follow. The level code is gonna be right beside me. I'll also throw it in the description below. That was, that was incredible. I'm actually really excited to see what other levels Lunar Scrap is going to come up with. I don't know if Lunar Scrap watches the channel or not, but if you do, my friend, that was an excellent job. Oh my goodness, that was so much fun playing the new courses. I want to keep going, but I think we've run out of time for this episode. But I wasn't sure how this was, was going to go, but after playing some of these new courses, it definitely makes me want to make another episode in the future. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Someone just uploaded a new course called the Muncher Castle. We got to play it. One more level. I mean, who would I be if I didn't play a level that was dedicated to me, man? I got to play it. This dude's going to be like, what the heck? Wow, this is this looks like it's going to be a really fun level too. The level creator is going to be like, what the heck? I just uploaded this. He didn't even get a chance to send me a tweet or message me in Discord that he had a level up. I'm already playing it. That's, <laughs> this is awesome. This is a really, really cool level already. I, wow. I'm liking this a lot, dude. This is, uh. I am already digging it, baby. Okay. Oh, I really wanted, I really wanted that Yoshi. Oh, my wish is my command. Oh. Thankfully, thankfully we got the checkpoint. This jump is actually kind of gonna be easier as smaller Mario. All right. Yeah, I'm digging this level. This level is a lot of fun. A lot of fun, there we go. I'm so glad we took the time to play this. this that was a great way to end it. So the troll level was amazing, but the, again, what are the odds? I, I mean, it blows my mind. It never ceases to blow my mind when I see a flipping hashtag DGR level. It blows me away, it humbles me so much, and I am incredibly thankful and grateful to everyone that makes these these levels for me. As I mentioned, the only thing I'm really curious about now is if RD Man was getting ready to, to send this to me on Twitter or something. He's getting ready to get a notification on Mario Maker that I played his level. That would be so funny. I wish so badly I could see his reaction. Now that's gonna wrap up this episode of the new courses. Again, I'm so pumped to do another episode of this. This was so much fun. We had a, quite the mixture. Good levels, absolutely awful trash levels, and good troll levels, bad troll levels. We had a hashtag GGR level. This had a little bit of everything, and again, it was so much fun. But we're gonna wrap things up. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and until next time.